Now we are doing exercise 4.2, question number 10. Question number 10, the number of degrees and grade in an angle are in the ratio 9 is to 10. Write, write a linear equation to express this statement. Solution. Let me change the color of the pen. Okay. Uh, so solution. What does the question says? Question says the number of degrees and grade in an angle are in the ratio 9 is to 10. Let's write a linear equation to express this statement. And so, okay, let x be the dig measures in angle measures in angle and y b measures in degree that was the measures of angle in degree degree and y b in gradient or grades okay so the number of degrees and grades in an angle are in ratio 9 is to 10 so given so given what is given so 9 divided by 10 is x divided by y right so i can cross multiply 9 into y it will be 9y is equal to 10x or i can transfer this 10x this side it will be 9y minus 10x is equal to 0 or 9y same thing you can transfer 9y this side and write down same thing like this so now this is our linear equation to express this then draw the graph of the same so we need to draw the graph okay so let us draw the graph so for drawing graph let me draw the evolution evolution for where is my eraser tabulation for what is that one 9y minus 10x is equal to 0 for 9y minus 10x is equal to 0 or you can write down 10x minus 9y same thing okay don't get confused here so let me draw the table so this is my crooked table so you make the good one okay so x y and this is x and y here so okay now if the major okay 36 and 70 so fine so instead of x okay let me try doing all these things so it is given here if the measure of an angle is 36 degree so let me take 36 degree so x is equal to 36 okay 9y is minus 10 into 36 is equal to 0 9y is equal to 10 into 36 360 transferring this side it will be plus 360 y is equal to 360 divided by 9 9 5 the 9 4 the 36 and 0 9 4 the 36 it is 40 y is equal to 40 x is 36 and y is 40 okay next when what is its measure in grade? So if the measure in grade, okay, next is 70 grade. So let me put y is equal to 70. So 9 into 70 minus 10 x is equal to 0. So 9 7 is 63 minus 10 x is equal to 0. So x will be equal to 630 divided by 10. Okay, what am I doing? I'm transferring 60, 30 this side and 10 dividing here. So 0, 0 out, it is 63. So I can get y is 70x will be 63 okay now let me try another number let me try just x is equal to 0 okay so 9y minus 10 into 0 is equal to 0 so 9y minus 10 0 to 0 is equal to 0 so y is equal to 0 divided by 9 which will be 0 so x is 0 y is also 0 now fine now let us draw the graph Okay, fine this much so while drawing the graph let's see uh, it is th x is 36 y is 40 so let me draw this is for x this is y this is negative of x and this is negative of y and here it is let's say 10 20 30 40 50 60 and 70 minus 10 minus 20 minus 30 minus 40 minus 50 minus 60 here it is 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 minus 10 minus 20 minus 30 
minus 40 minus 50 minus 60 minus 70 so x is 36 y is 40 x it is 30 and 6 so 35 36 somewhere here x is 36 y is 40 so let me change the color of my pen so it will be let me take this one here x is 30 x is 36 y is 40 x is 36 here y is 40 somewhere here so 36 and 40 it will be here this point is 36 comma 40 no, no 40 comma 36 sorry where is my eraser so 40 minus 36 40 and 36 <laughs> not minus 36 next have i written down same thing again um, what am i doing so this is 36 and 40 right so this point 40 is here okay and this is not this one so i've taken 36 here so 36 and 40 next point it is 63 and 70 so it is x is 63 so 63 will be somewhere here 63 63 here and 70 it is top here so this is 63 and 70 and next it is 0 0 so this is the point 0 0 so let me join the line and you're going to get a straight line and this is also another straight line can i draw a straight line from here uh there's a point pen okay that's all so and this will be a straight line okay passing through please do make it straight for me it is <laughs> horrible one but fine so i think it is correct one so that's all and this is 9y minus 10x so 9y minus 10x is equal to zero now let me answer the question question number one roman number one it says if the measure of an angle is 36 degree what is its measure in grades so if measure is 36 then in grades it is 40 right if it is 36 then it is 40 here right so roman number one answer is 40 grades what else if the measure of an angle is 70 grades what is its measure in degree so if it is 70 grades so 70 grades is this one why right this is for grades 70 grades it is 63 here so 63 63 degree roman number two it is 63 degree okay that's all i hope the answer is correct thank you so much we will meet in the next video